Yes. Okay. I think, I think mostly the books which you read are uh, non-fiction. Yes. Okay. Good. Very good. I uh, typically don't like to read non-fiction. I typically read fiction. I have yet to read a single uh, non-fiction book. I think so. I typically uh-huh. like to like to read fiction. Currently, also I'm reading a book on which is fiction. So, since how many years have you been into fitness? Since uh, six years. Since six or seven. Very good. And before that, what were you doing? Before that, I was working in a call center. I just says clerk. Hmm. Didn't like it. Yes. I'm assuming. No. Never ever. Because I think I was not made for that, or you know, for a place where we are not performing good. On the other hand, your boss is scolding you every day. He is dictating you. He is controlling your life. So I, I would no. I would. did not want to live those kinds of life okay. that is why i no, 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 i honestly switched. feel that uh, people who are into call centers i don't know whether i'm supposed to admire them or uh, you know not appreciate them because working in call centers is difficult actually difficult and, I, and i've got friends who have been working in call centers for a very long time they actually made their careers in call centers of course yeah it I, is i know a few people who have been on calls for 10 11 12 years And and I I don't know what to you know whether whether I should appreciate them or whether I should uh, be surprised that they have not done much because being on calls very difficult to listen to people. Uh, you you know you guys are representing a company, so you have to listen to everything, good, bad, mostly bad. Mostly bad. Your breaks are time, and I I find it very difficult. I, when I was working, I found it very difficult. Okay, you also been to call center? I worked in two BPOs. Okay, where Delhi? I I stay in Mumbai. Okay, you stay in Mumbai. Yeah, it's very hard, you know. Uh, after hard. keep talking, keep talking same thing again and again. Middle of the call, uh, if uh an odd customer, you know, encountered you, he will scold you, he will abuse you. If you encounter an odd customer, yeah. If you encounter odd customer, he will abuse you. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. And and it's difficult. It's a difficult job. It's yeah. Difficult. So yeah, I, I that's what I uh, and I as I said, I know I know two people at least I think so who have been working for a very long time, and I hope because I haven't spoken with them three three oh sorry I haven't spoken with them, but. Uh, Is that a Facebook profile says that are still on Teams, which still on call, and I hope they are not on call. I hope they have progressed uh, more than they can. I, I genuinely hope that. Okay, it's mm-hmm. a little uh, disappointing. Yeah, yeah. People are working for last five years, ten years, and they are getting promotion. Hmm. You see, I think if you are being promoted, it is fine. But if you are on calls, I think you should do something else then. <laughs> Yeah, but uh, you there is if we talk about the ratio of growth is very less, right? Because there are many, uh, I think many people in one uh, project or one team, right? That's in fact. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. And that is why uh, most of the employee leaves, you know, their job after six months, after one year, maximum. If someone is, you know, linger there, I think. Two or three years, maximum two or three years. If someone years, lingers there, lingers, plural. Linger, yeah. Someone lingers there. Two or three years, maximum. Hmm. Yeah. I know people who have been working the same place for same six seven years. And when I was working, there was a friend who was there for six years. He was on calls six years. Oh my god! And the now, salary now would be wonderful. Same. The salary would be same, I think. I don't know, but now it's good. Now he uh, he resigned, he moved out, and now he is in Qatar. He's in uh, Qatar. Wonderful, I think. A uh, very good. He's in he's in Qatar or he's in UAE. I'm not sure, but either mm-hmm. the, either the two countries he's staying, which is very good, because he seems to be doing well. I'm I'm genuinely happy for him. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> It is very nice. Right. Hey.
So, uh, what is your uh, how do I say? What is your routine? How many days do you work out? Six days. I work out six, six days. days. I, yeah. Okay. I, I train people six days in a week. <laughs> no, how many days do you work out? How six many days do you train people? Okay. okay. Yes. Because I love this work. I know mm. working out, taking care of your body, and, and this is not my job. This is my work. and uh, i love doing this so i don't want to you know take leave from my gym or from my training session i not gym gym is gym 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 okay okay good very good a, a friend of mm-hmm. mine uh, she also into this uh, and yeah she seems to be doing pretty well she seems happy that's very important yeah of course i'm also happy from my profession i'm also happy i think the books Because, which are on your instagram are the one which are behind you on your bookshelf maybe uh, i don't have put video on instagram of my bookshelf i, I, I don't no have. there were a lot of pictures a lot of i think i saw her i saw uh, maybe yeah yeah in a video there is a video i have put on instagram on that that would be no i sorry i cannot hear it Deepak, can you hear me now? Yes, I can hear you now. Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. Hmm. Yes. I was saying, I have a friend also. She is also into this, and she seems to be doing pretty well. She is happy. Even she was uh, unhappy with where her career was going professionally. And uh, once she got out, she seems more happy than what she was uh, and how she was earlier. Yes, uh, no. In your profession, if you are happy with your profession, it doesn't matter how much money you are making. You know, mm. the happiness is coming from your work, and that is more valuable than your money. Do do do. So, uh, your gym it's open for six days only, or it's open for seven days, and you work out for six days. No, I, I can. I'm a freelancer. I do not train people in the gym. Sometimes mm, whenever that I understood. Like, that I understood. Yeah, I'm a freelancer. I train people at their place in the park. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. So, which workouts do you think are good? Body weight or uh, body weight? Body weight, free weight. Body weight and free weight would be the same, right? Yeah, or weighted trainings. It's all about your goals, you know. Mm. What do you wanna? If you wanna build muscle, look, you know, big, then you must prefer weight training. If you wanna stand. And uh, so I'm asking this question for two reasons. First is because I'm I want to know for myself. Second is because we are talking about something which is um. Of a mutual interest. Plus, I can hear you talk. I can also correct. That's why I'm asking this. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. For a person like me, so I just told you, I'm an ectomorph, and I am not very interested in bulking up. I would prefer to have a lean physique. So for them, what what would you prefer? What would you suggest? Uh, and if you what, if you don't want to give free information, you can say I want to give free information. I'm okay with that. No problem. Uh, what is your height? What is your weight? I am five feet eleven. Uh, five, five, right now, I don't know how much I weight, how much my weight is. Last I checked was seventy five. 
25 I, i have gained uh, i have gained and i not gained good weight i have gained bad weight okay 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 so you see this is this is how my this is my wrist my wrist is as you can see this thick uh. but i have gained a lot of belly fat if you do you mind if i ask you to stand so that i can no no you? no i'm not going to stand i'm very ashamed right now <laughs> 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 not not no. i want to put it on you... youtube even more ashamed more shameful for me <laughs> <laughs> oh, no that's okay so no problem my viral <laughs> <laughs> no i think uh, this day uh, 80 to 90% people are unfit on this planet ha so, but i am not 80 to 90% i am only one me <laughs> i have the entire right to be ashamed of my body <laughs> no problem so, so a few months ago i was not as unfit as i'm right now today mm-hmm. i am genuinely unfit i'll tell you to what extent i stay on the third floor and we don't have a lift in the building i always climb the stairs because there's no lift and what i do is i skip a step i have always been doing this since years now i skip a step when i'm climbing up or when i'm going down and i would never feel uh, wheezy and i, I would never get out of you no know, breathless but now because i'm unfit and i've not been working out by the time i reach the third floor i'm slightly breathless slightly so i know i'm not very fit right now yeah i know like uh, when you run or when you do push ups or do body weight exercise high intensity the intensity direct goes on your heart mm. you know and when you frequently putting more intense pressure on your heart your heart become better stronger, stronger right as, as you mentioned two months or three months earlier you were good now you have you are not very bad because ha huh, because you have left exercise and that is why if you have left exercise of your body definitely your body not only your heart your body your lungs your tissues your muscles will go down <clears throat> per year you know so this was very deliberate thing to be honest was this was deliberate i decided i might as well stop working out for a bit mm-hmm. and i also met an accident so that that compounded i thought you know, oh, I, i i'll actually put in efforts to gain weight unfortunately i gained bad weight so now i have some motivation to go to the gym and start working out regularly yes yes you must you must work out regularly because till the time four days a week for five days a week is fine right five days four days a week uh huh well, if you are starting from three days in a week is enough after mm-hmm. three or four weeks you can start four days and then five days and then six days is at your convenience hmm makes sense ha oh, makes sense mm-hmm. because if i want to sustain something it makes sense to do it step by step you're right you're right step by step this is something yes. which i never thought about sustainability because when i would have to work out i would simply do it five days a week six days a week seven days a week but now this makes more sense if i start with three days a week i have that no i can do it if i can manage three days and i can move to four i can move to five this makes more sense yes and most of the people they you know in the beginner when they energize when they motivated they start working out two hours a day you know two hours a day five days or six days even seven days in a week ah. after two months they never see in the gym you know i'm motivated time, not disciplined <laughs> <laughs> yes uh, so that time he motivated that. he will like oh i am the hero of this gym and after <laughs> two months three months they left <laughs> they don't know where they are i completely agree with this i completely and agree the same way they start their journey of their fitness mm. this makes a lot so of sense start with no baby mm. steps go longer true 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 i should i should i should do this three weeks uh, three days a week will be fine then i can switch to four five so that yes mm. sustainability right and and sustainability bring you to the place where you want to be in fitness mm. right and i mean you know going for the gym single day for 9 hours doesn't bring you going for the gym shape. is incorrect going to the gym going to the gym for 9 hours you know it doesn't bring you into the shape but if you will keep working out for 20 minutes or 15 minutes every single day after 9 months or after 1 year you will see massive changes in your body hmm this is fine 
I, this makes more of a lot of uh, sense. <clears throat> Even fifteen minutes is enough. Twenty minutes is enough. But in fifteen minutes, how will you manage to work out? Because I think if, if you're working out for fifteen minutes, you're barely doing anything. Fifteen minutes, fifteen minutes, you will barely do two exercises. Let's say I'm I'm doing work chest workout today. Fifteen minutes, three repetitions. Okay. Let's say I do uh, barbell uh, chest barbell press. Print. Ah, chest barbell press. chest press and flat. And let's say I do uh, this thing, a uh, cross cable. So only two exercises did, no? So how will that help me? Two. You have to take little break, little break. Mm. You know, people perform one exercise and they take two or three or four minutes break. Right. So that's break mm. consuming for time. Go for thirty six maximum ninety seconds break, not more than that. Mm. But still, still deeper, still. Even if I'm taking a break for ninety seconds, I don't think that I'll be able to finish off more than two exercises in fifteen minutes. Maximum three, maybe, 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 maybe. Mm -hmm. My concern is if I'm only doing three exercises, how will that help me with my uh, with fitness? Only for fifteen minutes is my question. Because I feel um, that forty-five minutes to an hour is good, but fifteen minutes I think is too less. Maybe for individual is too. You know, a little time, but okay. I will suggest you. Uh, how I can say, something is always better than nothing. Okay. Okay. Right. Doing a little action is better than not doing at all. Okay, makes sense. Right. And that's how this people book. ask me, how do you, uh, people, uh, do you read, you know, once a one book in a week, how do you read? I start with baby steps. I start, when I started reading a book, you know, I started one paragraph, hmm. then two paragraph. That's how I built my, I had committed to myself. Before hitting the bed, I have to read one paragraph of book. And now I finish a book in a week. Very good. If I could suggest something to you, because you are reading. Uh, no, I'm assuming you are reading to gain knowledge. If I could suggest this to you, read one book twice. <clears throat> yeah, I do. Not twice. I try even seven of ten times. I read book. I have a one of, no, back to back, back to back, back to back, back to back. Back? No, I don't do back to back. Let, let me explain to you why. The first time you read the book, read because you want to gain knowledge. Then when you are done, read the book again. If you if you are comfortable, if you are able to do it. The second time you read the book, simply to understand what is the English which is used, because you are here, you want to improve your English, and I'm also giving you feedback right now. Your confidence is nice. You you are expressing yourself nicely. You're putting in efforts. Your confidence is good. You're putting in efforts. You're putting in. You know, it's obvious that you want to learn. So, the second time when you read the book, that will be more from the point of view of learning the English which is written. You'll come across a lot of you. You might come across a lot of things which you must have missed earlier because. See, for example, when I'm watching a movie, when I'm watching a movie for the first time, I want to get entertained, so I'll miss out on a lot of things. But the second time when I watch the movie, immediately after the first time, now I'll pick up on a few more things. Yeah, you are right. I know what's going to happen in the movie. That's why this is my this is my suggestion to you. You are right. Yes, yes. But I don't read back to back. After two or three weeks, I'm suggesting books. you to read back to back. Okay, okay. Sure, sure. sure. I'm suggesting you to read back to back. So I will do that. Mm -hmm. so from where do you buy these books? I buy from book fair or Amazon, Flipkart. Amazon, okay. Amazon, Amazon. Okay. Amazon is I think has very good titles available. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So anyone recommends you these books, or you pick up these books on your own? Okay, okay. I'm gonna ask you a question. I'm anyone sorry. recommends you these books? Evan, anyone recommends you these books, or you pick up these books on your own? I uh, no uh, authors, the people who I follow on Instagram, social media, they hmm. recommend. Instagram or Instagram, Instagram. Instagram. Instagram, yes. Instagram, they hmm. recommend or or buy. Myself also, according to my you know my interest, I choose the book. Okay. 
in my locality there is a library so mm-hmm. i go there and i rent my books okay nice i think in in i asked in mumbai by the way so i think it is one of the very few libraries which i have in my locality which has this available so very nice mm-hmm. so currently nice. i'm reading a book which was gifted to me by my by my sister okay. on my window still i'm reading that book i'll show it to you mm-hmm. this is the book which i'm reading okay david balkosi i don't know how to pronounce the name i think it's baldachi so it's david baldachi book baldachi, baldachi. baldachi. Ah, david baldachi okay okay ha uh-huh. ha He's one of my favorite yeah. authors. He writes very well. So I'm okay. currently reading this book. Nice. And I've been reading this book since six or seven months now. I started. I stopped reading. Again, I started. I stopped reading. Again, I started. I stopped reading. This is this is the maximum progress which I've made now. I've managed to reach the eighth chapter. earlier i would stop around the fourth or third chapter to now i managed to read the eighth chapter but now i'm, I'm finding the book also a little interesting so uh, i push myself to read before i sleep a bit sometimes i do it sometimes i don't manage to do it yeah i'm pushing i think i'll get inspired by what you do at least a paragraph <laughs> so i'll do that now yes sir 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 uh-huh. because the concept of baby steps and sustainability i know about it and i tell this to a lot of people but today while i was speaking with you i realized that when it comes to my workouts also i have to be adopting adapting, adopting the same thing the taking baby step when it comes to your workouts and i think anything which you do baby step is always good it it helps you to become more um, mm-hmm. disciplined and to sus- make things more sustainable yeah you will be sustainable in that craft in that action because what people say oh i go to gym I go to the gym for one hour oh it will take long time one hour is enough so if i will ask you go for 15 minutes you would be interested oh it's going to take 15 minutes not more than that right ha huh. so that's how you can build interest if i will ask you to read just one paragraph you just have it will, it is going to take you more than 2 minutes if you are slow reader more than 2 minutes three minutes then you are ready to invest 2 minutes what but after you finishing that chap work you know you feel confident after you finish oh, after you finished you know that work you feel confident oh i have done one yeah. mark oh, one work true, that true. i is committed absolutely true absolutely true absolutely true so, so after that, ramzan's what i'm going to do i'm going to feel proud after one week is over because i went to the gym thrice and after some time like it four days a week five days a week that's what i'll do yes I'll nice do that, that. nice thank mm-hmm. you for the, thank you for the inspiration <laughs> no problem <laughs> and i'm i'm definitely going to contact you sure 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 you because you i i need a uh, a good diet plan or i think the, my workouts are fine i know which workouts to do because mm-hmm. i have been working out since some time so i know the forms that those things i know a bit uh my biggest concern is diet and honestly i am a foodie so i like to eat food so i think i need a diet which gives me the balance of you know tasty food healthy food <laughs> balanced tasty food healthy food yeah if you goal is to i think your goal would be to build you know strength and muscles that's it yes 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 and to lose a very fat and you can manage yeah then little bit you have to sacrifice you know your know sweet I mean. yeah little bit yeah i have a sweet i was sweet jaw not a sweet but i was sweet jaw <laughs> <laughs> Right. Yes. But I think if if a person has a sweet thing, one piece of chocolate in the morning is in the morning is fine, right? When your metabolism is at the highest, I believe that. Is it right? Is it a good belief? I avoid to take. Uh, I ask. Oh. It's all about no. You can take. You may take. You know. But I think uh, if the chocolate is carrying two hundred, three hundred calorie, then that would be hard. Mm, harmful. True. True. Yeah, yeah. That Let's see. Be... I am planning to be a little more disciplined when I start my workouts. Not mm-hmm. managed to do it till till now. Maybe mm-hmm. when I actually start working out, things might change. I don't know. 
Yes, mm. yes. 